Hello everybody, welcome back to the channel. We're gonna have another display video by request. Someone, several, a few videos back requested in the comments that we did more display videos. And um, this is for you, man. So this is, um, while you're looking at the overall thing, calling this late spring early summer display because as you'll see we're in the time period where we're starting to cut wheat barley canola so let's just start off over here i took out the big barn that we normally have right here just so i could kind of change it up move some of the stuff you can see mix it up just a little bit from normal just, I know I didn't want every video, every display video to have the same setup every single time. So over here we have dump truck, flatbed, pickup truck. Just kind of sitting there waiting to be used. And over here is a little boat trailer. Ain't nothing special. It's a matchbox. But I thought, you know, let's put that on the display, display as a prop. And uh, here's another service truck uh, custom we've done. So it's got the Peterbilt. Uh truck and then the really big service bed from uh, Rock and H. Really cool stuff. Check them out. Um, over here we have a like the cargo trailer. It's a Rule King one. Got that a Rule King a few years back. Earl makes. Got the T9 on track. Smart tracks. The big Kinsey. Little, little spray tank. You know nothing. Just some random stuff kind of hanging around. Got the fuel tank of course. And in this barn we have uh, the 340 Madam with the gravity wagon. We have the Challenger on triples, the Spreader. We have the Tonka made Silverado with horse trailer. Just kind of going through the farm. In the barn, we have the 9RT, case combine trailer. So, you know, they're getting service. We have another pickup truck. And over here, we have a little, it's a 68 Camaro. And, you know, some of y'all may be this way. It seems like a lot of. Farmers seem to have an old, really nice old car. So I thought I'd put that in there. We're here in this field, we got a 8220 uh, with a disc. And I forgot to mention, this is, there's no particular brand on this one. It's not like a John Deere display or case display or Agco, whatever. Um, so this, is, it's all my personal stuff. Uh, here we have the 9670 STS bullet rotor. Uh, those are custom tires we put on there. On the front and back and it's pulling its own uh header cart with the header with the disappointment header from Ertl but I do think it's cool that uh, combines pull their own header cart over here with an old Ford tractor working some hay there we have a semi say a Freightliner Ertl and the Ertl cheap Ertl grain trailer over here we have two class 9 cases. We have the uh, 9240 and 9250. Just made a video on that. Check it out. And over here we have uh, two tractors on dirt pans. 620 quad track John Deere dirt pan. Over here 9420 scraper special. Same dirt pan. And then over here in this field we have the Delta track. Versatile Delta track 550 with this uh, John Deere air seeder planting after, we'll say after they cut some wheat or barley, canola planting. You know, it could be uh, soybeans or even milo, um, depending on where some regions, y'all probably plant it, they plant it around here some, but we put that custom John Deere GPS on it, because if you know versatiles don't come with any, uh, they come where ready to be used with any type you so choose and so I was like you know what I think I'm gonna put a some JD link on there so we did so there we have it kind of a flyby job there is a little faster than I thought it was gonna be but we see we we'll walk around still um, end of spring beginning of summer display here so like I said at the beginning this was by request so if you have request for uh, videos put them in the comments we'll look into it for sure so uh thanks for watching and don't forget to like and subscribe and hit that notification button to see when we're making and posting videos have a good day